Hi there, welcome to Sun Power Yoga Practice. We are going to uh, be starting with our sun salutations straight away. You've done some of the classes already probably where we'll move through the breath exercises. So let's come up to stand and start here two inches from the front of our mats. Inhale. And exhale, hands down our centre. Crossing your thumbs. Inhale, reach up and back. And exhale, forward fold, Uttanasana, draw your abdomen in. Inhale, right leg back, knee down, chest up. Retain the breath, plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin to the floor. Inhale, push through, lift your heart. Ujjayas. Tuck the toes, exhale, and the Mukhasvanasana. Inhale, right foot forward, knee down, chest up. Exhale, step in, forward fold. Inhale, reach to right. Remember, every movement has a breath. Exhale, forward fold. Palms down, bend the knees if you need to. Inhale, left leg back, knee down, chest up. Retain breath, Kumbhakasana. Exhale, Ashtanga, Namaskar. Inhale, Ujjanasana. Tuck the toes, exhale, add whole Mahasanasana. Inhale, left foot forward, knee down, chest up. Exhale, step in, Uttanasana. Inhale, reach to right, breathing loads of lovely prana. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, right leg back, knee down, chest up. Retain breath, Mahasanasana. Exhale, Ashtanga, Namaskar. Inhale, slide through, lift your heart. Tuck the toes, exhale, and hold the Mahasanasana. Inhale, right foot forward, knee down, lift your heart. Exhale, stepping in, crown of the head, heading towards the feet. Inhale, rise, extended, Tadasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, left leg back, knee down, chest up. Retain breath, plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin. Inhale, sliding through the lift. Tuck your toes, exhale, and hold Sanasana, downward facing dog. Inhale, left foot forward, knee down, chest up. Exhale, step in, forward fold. Inhale, reach to rise. Another round, so that's right and left. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, right leg back, knee down, chest up. Retain breath, Kumbhakasana. Exhale, Ashtanga, Namaskar. Inhale, Ujjanasana. Tuck the toes, exhale, and hold the Sanasana. Let's stay here for about four or five breaths. Please, if it feels too intense, put your knees down and rest in child's pose. Fingers are spread, middle finger forward, arms long, tailbone high. Feel your shoulder blades moving down the back ribs. Retain breath, plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest and chin. Inhale, slide along, lift your heart. Tuck the toes, exhale. And inhale, left foot forward. Exhale, step in. Inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart centre. Lovely, okay, let's come with our feet apart. About five and a half foot lengths apart, with the heels 
turn out slightly and the knees, sorry, not the knees, the toes turn in a little. Be strong through your legs, engage all of the muscles. Moving on, let's inhale and reach for the sky. Feel really long. Exhale, forward fold. And as you fold, cradle your elbows, one in each hand. Allow your head to move down towards the earth. Maybe give it a very gentle shake and then relax. And we'll just sway from side to side here. Notice the sensations in the back of the legs, in the pelvis, through the spine, and the shoulders. Popping the hands to the floor, walk your hands forward, let your heels rise, and then as you exhale, push back into wide leg downward dog. So, 
face me down or you can turn your gaze up. The chin gently tucks in. Inhale and as you exhale, extend your triangle. Turning your gaze down. Inhaling, come all the way safely up. Exhale, bring your toes forward. The other foot, if it's on the heel, and turn the foot out. A little bit of a draft, two. Look along the line of your hand and settle in. Try and have your hips over the middle, sorry, your shoulders over the middle of your hips. Be aware of the back edge of your back foot connecting with the earth. Let's inhale and lift the left. Exhale, reach back. Coming up, resting on the thigh and arm on the belly, dropping the hips. Extend. And again, let's come up to reverse. And come forward, side arm. Coming all the way back up, straightening the leg. Remember here, it's important to really use your quads to protect your knee. Reach forwards, come on down. Trick balance and spreading the toes, lift the inner arches, and engage the legs and the muscles of the legs. Tuck your chin in and gaze up. And reaching past. Feel this all the way from your top hip on the side of your body to your fingers. Turning the gaze down. Inhale and reach all the way up. Bring your arms and turn your toes forward. Stepping the feet wider than a yoga mat. Pressing your pumps. Be comfortable in your feet, in your knees. Don't force anything out too much. Hands to heart centre, lowering down into goddess pose. Wake up your legs. Breath is steady. Let's go to help to steady the mind. Crossing for the thumbs. Inhale, reach. Exhale, settle a bit more. Taking the arms out, push the walls away. Reaching all the way up. Bring your hands to heart centre. Oh, come on out. Walk your feet safely. A little bit of a shake for the legs if you need to. And we'll come to Tadasana, mountain pose. Bring your hands in. Watch your hands will reach up. Let's take a lovely stretch to the right. Present room. Come up and over to the left. Coming down, a variation of crane pose. So rise through your right leg, either under the thigh or around the shin. And draw the leg in. Grow really, really tall. Opening out to star pose. Feel like the star shining bright. And then falling star. yourself back up, raise your heels into your arrow, and gently lower. Let's release the left heel, left leg coming up, draw yourself in. Opening out into star. When you're ready, a little lean. Bring yourself back. Hands together, feet together. Inhale, rise up through your heels. Keep your heels lifted. Lower yourself down. Lift through your heart. Listen to the knees. 
opening your hands in this little balance here. We're really tall through the crown. Hands come back in, squeezing the heels, the inner thighs together. Inhale and rise. Exhale. Return to mountain pose.
Think of retracting your shoulders, squeeze through the butt ribs. And then you bring the chin in and gently lower back down. Use your hand to pose my legs. Lift your heart and rest your head down just on the knees. Untying ourselves, we're coming onto the front, all the way down. At the bottom end, the toes, big toes are together, the heels are apart. And up here, we're going to practice things first, first, no way to start here. Inhale, just lift up onto your forearms. Exhale, lower back down. We get inhale, lifting up. Exhale, lower down. Once more, then inhale, lift. And exhale, lower. Progressing, slide your hands further back. Poke your elbows up to the sky and tuck them. Inhale, come to baby cobra. Exhale, lower down. Keep your shoulders right away from your shoulders, from your ears. Again, inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Just one more then. Inhale, lift. And exhale, lower down. Taking your legs about that distance apart, bend the legs. There's a couple of ways you can work with both pose, down right center. You can reach around and hold the front of your ankles. If you have the knee injury, flex your feet. It'll be a bit safer. Alternatively, you can reach inside. It's going to give you a little bit more opening around the front of your body. Inhale, lift the arms straight, pushing your leg the way. Exhale, lower. Again, inhale, lift, opening the heart center. Exhale, lower. Once more, inhale, rise. And exhale. Release your feet. Turn your head. And maybe just rock your hips. Take a moment here just to settle. And then we'll turn our toes under. Hands underneath. And just gently come on up. Nothing too extreme for the back. I'd like you to try a very shallow cat gentle, ease out, be stressed, and maybe sitting in your lower spine up to the back one, and we'll hit, do a bit of cat now. And release. Coming to the floor, we'll practice Sajjan Mandasana, bridge pose, and then Matsyasana, fish pose. Bridge is going up to strengthen the back again, front of your body. Fish pose will help to bring in loads of freshly oxygenated blood. Really, when we exhale fully getting into the base of the lungs. So let's do those two together. Please remember to come down very safely. Bend your legs, feet maybe a little bit wider than hip distance apart. Feel your spine up off the floor. Just press your palms down. You can roll your shoulder blades under a bit more. Hold your hands. You just stay here with me. This is a semi-inverted posture. I'm going to be giving the heart a gentle rest. And there's also a little bit of nourishment for the thyroid and parathyroid. Sitting just in the throat. So underneath now, cross your thumbs like this and spread your fingers. Lower yourself down. Uncross your thumbs. Extend your legs. Flex your feet. You must keep your feet flexed and 
keep the mat closed. In a bucket, we're going to be rising up, resting on the forearms, on the hands, very lightly on the head. And we'll stay there for five fabulous breaths. Inhale, lift. Sometimes you have to look a little bit deeper. 
Thank you for joining me for some Hala Yoga practice today. I'll see you soon. Namaste.